That's the one I gave you. Huh, it is? Nice try, mister. You can't fool me. I think we still need a few more. Which should we pick next? Good eye. People used to give these to declare their loyalty to one another. Interesting, right? She said, as many as you can carry, so maybe a few more? I think we're good now. What do you say? Shall we go? to hurry we're not under the gun or anything i'm not cut out for this crap sure you are and when you're done you'll be drowning in job offers these flowers don't know well we'll soon find out I'll wait out here. Oh, okay. But I might be a while. Why not check out the town? <sighs> Come on! But I want to climb up there. No, it's much too dangerous. But I have to climb up there so people will like me and think I'm cool. Ugh. How do kids come up with these silly games? But I'm scared of the doggy. That's what's called easy money. We even got to be on TV. And to think, all we had to do was... Gotta melt it down. We need to use for it. I understand you must be busy, but I hope you haven't forgotten about my research.
Cloud, I have come up with the most fascinating theory. Perhaps you can lend me your assistance in gathering data to test it? Cloud, I have the most amazing news! I believe I might know how to develop summoning materia, something heretofore thought impossible. Scientists say that this materia can only be found in nature, but I may just be able to prove otherwise. And so, Cloud, I turn to you. I would like to test this theory by way of my combat simulator. To wit, I want you to fight and defeat summon data in VR. I sense that you find my phrasing to be somewhat... obtuse. Please let me know when you have made your preparations. I have to tell you that I am grateful for all of your help thus far. I've done it! I've developed a new materia! I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. I've got the finest collection of materia you'll find anywhere. Materia, no life. I heard soldiers have eyes that sparkle just like materia. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will. That's a lesson for life from the ground floor. Got what you need to stay safe? I'd love to say something, but I don't want to cross the line of the reactor. Those avalanche guys are unbelievable. Without... Man, how about it? You hungry? Mm -hmm. What if you fall and break your neck? Did you know? This place is haunted. It's, it's haunted? When rich people walk through here, their gill and jewels magically disappear. Years ago, when I came to Midgar, the plate you see now was only halfway finished. Really? Midgar wouldn't be Midgar without the plate and the reactors. They become thieves.
This here's the Sector 5 Community Center. This is gonna get dark around here. Aerith is such a sweetheart. Us folks of the day. Well, shit. Hope he gives a rousing speech. Gets everybody fired up and ready to fight. Come on, Dad, where are you? I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. I hope you will continue to help me gather vital information for my research. Then I invite you to ready your portable battle simulator. Do your thing.
You're done. It's over. Let's go. Outstanding. The Shiva summoning materia is complete. And now it's yours. Use it as you see fit. The Lady of Frost is the perfect companion for a man like you, Cloud. She will prove most useful when the time comes to destroy Shinra. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel submissions. You won't stop telling us stories about that damn reactor. <sighs> Just got in a big old shipment of beverage, Doctor! This is enough to keep anyone a couple of drinks out. Got nothing but the best here. I knew you had a keen eye. on my front door, goddamn squeaky. Almost as loud and annoying as the missus. Easy fixes. A couple of drinks out will get the spot right about now. I heard soldiers have eyes. Oh, yeah? And what's with the bitching? You won't stop telling us stories about that damn reactor. Uh, wait. Get your hands on the hottest uh, new uh, scent. Sustaining uh, Chocobo. <sighs> It'd be great if they asked us again. But I'm scared of the doggy. Don't give up! Is this right? I wish I knew what those avalanche people were thinking. Years ago when I... ...came to Midgard. <laughs> You know, this place is hot. Finally got pounds. It's not safe up there. Oh. I remember you. Where's Aerith? The Leaf House. Is something wrong? You could say that. Sounds like someone spooked the kids. Yeah, two of them disappeared. They ran away after this creepy guy wearing black clothes showed up. A Turk? That's what I thought, but no. It's this guy who's always stumbling around town in a dirty robe full of holes. They say he's sick or something. 
Oh, and he had some kind of number tattooed on his arm. I don't like the sound of this. I'm gonna check it out. I know someone who fits that description. I'll come with. Okay. Come on. Place is off limits to groups. But if we want to rescue them, well, we gotta break the rules. Come to help. Yeah, leave it to us. We'll take care of it from here. But there are monsters out there! Don't worry. I've brought a super strong friend along with me. I used to be a soldier. So where's the guy? I don't know. He disappeared and we can't find him. Right now, let's worry about the kids. Come on. This way. Be careful. Huh. Where do you think they went? Who knows? They're kids. Nothing to do but look all over. I just hope we find them in time. I've got this. Don't you mean we've got this? <laughs> Sorry. Let's finish this. Get him! <laughs> That's that. It's over. Cut, that's over. Piece of cake. Then. Ah, there they 
are. And they're not alone. Bring it. Get him! Huh? Stay back! Hey! It's over. That's that. Here it comes. Not bad. Try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. You're mine. So long. Enough. That's it. Brace yourself. This one's for you. Quickly, we gotta save them. All right. Head back. Well, you see, Cloud here used to be a soldier. He was? Did you go fight in the war? I might have. Oh, 
Well, this isn't good. It's over. Go on! Get him! I'm gonna grow up to that be a soldier. That wasn't so bad. Like you. You can't just grow up to be a soldier. You gotta work at it. Cloud thinks I'm good enough to be one, right? Look at you, Mr. Popular. That was so cool, you guys. Especially that. Oh, yeah! Yeah, it was really cool, and you went like. Yeah! Yeah! You've got it all wrong. Like that. No way. It was way faster than that. Yeah! Yeah! Like that! Fine. Then how about. Nothing. Is Tifa like your girlfriend? No. Hmm, but she's someone special. It's not like that. More like... I don't know how to explain. I see. Thank you. From now on, if you run into trouble, promise me you'll find an adult, okay? Okay, I will. And here, since you're so cool, you guys are both grown-ups, but you're also one of us now. You can come and play here whenever you want. Thanks for helping our friends. Pretty damn similar. Huh? There's the number, but why two? Who knows? Come to think. <laughs> the reunion. There's <laughs> nothing to fear. <laughs> Sephiroth is. Do you? Sephiroth, the war hero? I know he died in an accident five years ago. They said so on the news. Maybe they did. But I've got a feeling he's still alive. Oh, right. Come on, let's go. Mm, then you must be from the legendary... The legendary... Uh... What was the next line again? Hey Cloud! I know a lot of people around here need help. When I'm out on patrol, a lot of them tell me about their problems. 
do you think you might be interested in helping out? Well, I'm all for it. We still have plenty of time. I'm on the clock. Don't worry. I give you permission. I always have the latest information. Come find me if you want to know. Then you two must be very, very special people. In that case, welcome to the Moogle Emporium. I'm the owner, Moggy. You must not be familiar with Mog the Moogle. It's a pretty famous fairy tale. Mog wanted to bring happiness to all the Moogles of the forest, so he decided to open a shop of wonders. That's right, Koopa. I open a store to bring happiness to the slums, like Mog. And you know, only people with the purest of hearts can even see Moogles. Uh, are you talking about me? Well, Moogle magic isn't perfect, Koopa. Anyway, we've collected all kinds of rare and wondrous goods. They can be yours if you've got enough Moogle medals. But they'll need to buy a membership first. Medals, you can spend them here, Koopa. So, Moggy, what do you do with the medals we give you? Oh, you know what? I use them to make everyone happy. That's the duty of every Moogle. Of course, just like Mog the Moogle. I see you're working hard, Mr. Merc. Yep. So what are you gonna do next? Keep on working hard. As you always do, I'm sure. You know, this is how I earn a living. Huh? Really? I thought you were just doing it for fun. I suppose some people do. Hello, I'm some people. Nice to meet you. Koopa. Which means I can bring happiness to a ton of people. Good for you. Hey, Cloud. Maybe say it like you mean it? Not until I'm happy. Go on, work your magic. Make me smile. From ear to ear. I'll need a lot more medals, Koopo. Well, that won't do. Come on, Cloud. Let's go get more. Good luck, guys! The monsters out there are getting stronger and stronger. But that's no problem for you, though, right? Be careful, anyway.
Well, she was... Since he heard about I had what happened. Back to our gum or chokeable candy. You mind taking a look? Hey, hey! Who's that guy? The very you first there? Undercity night out. So hey, do you think this any means more? Another war's coming. Shinra weapons are on the rampage. Five of them, like floating eyeballs. I saw them wander off into the scrap, but if they come back into town, it'd be a disaster. We need someone who's willing and able to fight. So, do you think this means another war's coming? I'll handle it. You will? Oh man, you're the best! I could hear them shouting intruder detected or some other nonsense when they floated off. Be careful, they look sure dangerous. Not. I've been out here all night watching the fire. Guess I gotta. Uh, 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 
So it's my turn? Tagging out! I'll take care of them! Focus. I got your number. Never in doubt. Leave this to me. I don't think so. Enough. You're done. Made with homegrown spices.
try to stay behind me. That way I can cover your back. <laughs> This isn't a game. Focus. Trust me, I'm focused. Brace yourself. I heard, I heard, you got them all, right? Robots from the reactor getting lost in the slums. According to officials, must be because of the explosion up top, huh? They must have thought they were protecting the reactor and figured I was trespassing on their turf or something. Maybe. Almost feel sorry for getting all lost and confused like that. Oh, what am I saying? Man or machine, Shinra bitches get what they deserve. Now hold on. Anyway, I think it's safe to say our work here is finished. If you're ever in the market for a Merc again, remember, you can count on Cloud. Uh, sure. And sorry about putting this on you all of a sudden. I'm really glad you were willing to help out, though. Thanks again. Actually, while you're here, I've got another favor to ask. There's this old guy who hangs out in front of the weapons shop. I think he might need your help. Would you mind talking to him? And amid this growing hostility, many believe that war is inevitable. I'd appreciate it if you could talk to that old guy. He helped me out a while back, and I'd like to return the favor. Those avalanche guys are unbelievable! Now you can handle yourself. See you soon. Oh, I know you. You must be that mercenary. I have a problem. It's the anniversary of my wife's death and I wanted to visit her grave. But I can't because some creatures have turned the graveyard into their nest. Could you do me a favor and go there in my stead? She shouldn't be alone today. It'll cost you. That's fine, that's fine. The graveyard's right by the head of the river. But I heard they put a new gate in recently to replace the old broken one. Now that those creatures have moved in, I'm sure it's locked up tight. A key to the graveyard, huh? I know. Why don't we ask Oats about it? The bombers are believed to have gone into hiding. I'd love to say something. Fight out of work. Talk to that guy. A large scale search led by military forces is currently being planned. They crossed the line bombing reactor. You heard what they said on TV. But I thought we weren't fighting for them. Though the ceasefire was declared five years ago, the flags are still back. He promised to take me to see the reactor. Gramps has been feeling a lot better ever since he heard about what happened.
Wait, you're not looking for the key to the graveyard gate, are you? Well, it's your lucky day. Our local hero swiped it from some public security jerks. She gave it to Margie, so I'm guessing he's selling it for medals now. Hey, you don't happen to have a key to a graveyard, do you? Of course! The Emporium has everything, Koopa! you guys. I've got a whole mountain of Moogle medals now. Soon I'll be able to make everyone here super happy. That's wonderful. So, like Mog the Moogle, you'll be able to make all our hopes and dreams come true? Not just yours, Koopa. The wishes of every single person in the slums. It's a lot of wishes. Lots of people in Midgard love to collect Moogle medals, you know. They'll pay anything to get their hands on more. I'm using the money to set up more shops all throughout the slums, Koopa. I'm giving jobs to the other kids and making life better for everyone here. And that's how I'll make everyone happy. That's one way of doing it, Koopa. And I've got extra happiness for you two. So what's to stop us from selling directly to these collectors? Uh, Moogle Magic, Koopa? Next time, keep your plans to yourself. Thanks, you guys. By working together, I know we can make the world a happier place. So, do you think this means another war is coming? <laughs> Come on. I'm with you. Let's go. That'll do. Just, just go. Too bad. Your mind. Never again. Say a prayer too? No thanks. I think you've got it covered.
I'm really grateful for what you did. Here's your reward. I owe him a lot. Maybe more than I can ever repay. And now, I owe you a lot, too. I know it's not much, but I hope it makes up for it a little bit. We paid our respects to your wife. And we took care of those creatures. Oh, that's such a relief to hear. I can't tell you how much it was weighing on my mind. I was beginning to think I might never be able to visit her grave again. With my bad back and my legs, my whole body's a mess, frankly. I... I didn't think I could make it past the creatures. But I was prepared to die trying. And then you two came along. Still, I've got to face facts. Creatures or no, I can't keep making these trips. Don't say that. This is the graveyard key. Run it back to Moggy. But I just told you about my legs. Why don't you just give it back? Okay. It'll cost you 5,000 gil, though. 5,000? It's always money with you people. <laughs> Fine. I won't ask you for anything else. I'll take your damned key and give it to the boy. Oh, it's downright depressing. What is the world coming to these days? It feels good to help people out, doesn't it? Yeah. You having fun yet? Heaps. Then you can't be afraid to show it more. Don't forget, it's all about service and salesmanship. I'll leave that to you. All right, but don't think you can rely on me forever, mister. Wasn't planning to. That's good. Cause I command a very good salary. years ago, the frog like was still fresh. As the right. children we interviewed yes. earlier today, whose parents died in the war, they were the same. Right? And Everything the 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 I heard there's someone Whoa. running around. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. 
So, what'll it be? Come back any time. Man, the hinge is on my foot. Should I head home? Oh, it'd be great if they asked us again. Oh. Oh. Can we pet him? Go for it! Oh. You're that former soldier, aren't you? Cloud, was it? Former soldier turned problem solver. Are you okay, Miss Folia? You look upset. Uh, yeah, I am pretty upset. The kids are still off doing patrols, even though it's now time for their lessons. Not a single one of them has come back yet. Patrols? Is that a Leaf House thing? Something they do to help out? That's right. In return for the donations we receive, the kids go around town picking up litter, running errands, that kind of thing. I don't suppose you've seen any of them, have you? <sighs> you see... I have some important plans this evening, and I really need to go and get ready. Would you like us to go round them up? Oh, that would be wonderful. There are five of them out on patrol right now. They all wear homemade swords on their backs, so they should be easy to spot. 